morning, boys and girls, mums and dads, grannies and grandpas and aunties and uncles. Um, welcome to Book Bug Live um, with me, Lindy, on the Golson Estate in the Isle of Lewis. Um, as usual, if you want to let me know you're here, just pop a wee comment in the comment section and I'll say hello. If we've got any birthdays, um, that you want me to sing happy birthday to, we can do that as well. Um, and we'll get started today. Today's theme for our book bug is all about animals. So all our songs and stories will have animals in them today. Um, and we'll start with the hello song, the way that we always do. So if we get our hands on our knees and we start clapping, and we sing hello everyone, Hello everyone, how are you today? Hello everyone, hello everyone, how are you today? Hello Jamie and Georgie, hello Katie and Lexi, hello Archie and Angus, and hello Harrison I think if you were here this morning. Um, who else have we got? Let me know in the comments and we'll do a wee hello and shout out to you throughout the session. So our first song this morning has this little guy in it and there's lots of them about just now because it's springtime. It's my little sheep. So we're going to sing Ba Ba Black Sheep. Ba Ba Black Sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame. And one for the little boy who lives down the lane. Do we all know that one? Will we try it again? Oh, morning, Peggy and Ian. Nice to see you again. Yeah, let's try Baba Black Sheep again. Baba Black Sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame, and one for the little boy who lives down the lane. Oh, lovely boys and girls. Okay, this one is a bit of a tongue twister. Who knows what a tongue twister is? It's quite hard to say sometimes when you get the words muddled up. So we'll have to be slow to start with. It's called Hey Diddle Diddle. Hey Diddle Diddle. The cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun, and the dish ran away with the spoon. Silly, isn't it? Will we try it again? Yeah, will we go faster? Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun, and the dish ran away with the spoon. Imagine your dishes and your spoons could run away. It'd be great if they could run all the way into the sink and do the dishes themselves. That'd be good. Mummies and the daddies would like that. One more time. Let's see how fast we can do it. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun. fun. Oh, I've done it wrong. And the dish ran away with the spoon. Oh, well. Now this is another one about a little girl and all the animals that she had. And it's called Katie Bardy. Katie Bardy had a coo, black and white about the moo. Wasn't that a dainty coo? Dance, Katie Bardy. So you can get up and dance, boys and girls. Diddly idle, idle dum, diddly idle, idle dum, diddly idle, idle dum. Dance, Katie Bardy. Katie Bardy had a hen, toddle butt and toddle pen. Wasn't that a dainty hen? Dance, Katie Bardy. Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum. Dance, Katie Bardy. Katie Bardy had a pick. Wasn't that a dainty pick? No, she didn't. Aye, she did. Dance, Katie Bardy. Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum. Dance, Katie Bardy. Katie Beardy had a cat that would both chase both mouse and rat. Wasn't that a hungry cat? Dance, Katie Bardy. Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum. Dance, Katie Bardy. 
Katie Berry had a duck, it would have the best of luck. Wasn't that a lucky duck? Dance Katie Bardy. Hiddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum. Diddly diddle diddle dum, dance Katie Bardy. Katie had a crocodile. Haven't you seen her in a while? Dance Katie Bardy, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, dance Katie Bardy. Oh, and that was a tongue twister as well, some of that. What do you think happened? Where, what did the crocodile do to Katie Bardy? I hope it didn't eat her. Mmm. Maybe we'll sing that one again later. Oh. Oh, Harrison's practising his tongue twisters. Is he getting on all right with it? <laughs> Great. Now, I've got a wee book about a cat. And this book is called Tabby McTat. This is a good one. Tabby McTat was a busker's cat with a meow that was loud and strong. And the two of them sang of this and that, and people threw coins in the old checked hat, and this was their favourite song. Me, you, and the old guitar, how perfectly, perfectly happy we are. Me, you, and the old guitar, how perfectly happy we are. One morning while well, Fred ate some bacon and bread, McTat took a stroll round the block, then stopped for there on a doorstep sat a gorgeously glossy and green-eyed cat. She was black with one snowy white paw. Sock and McTat had a cat-to-cat -cat chat, and that's how their story began. For while they were chatting of this and that, a thief had his eye on the old checked hat. He eyed it, he snatched it, he ran. The busker gave chase, but he tripped on a lace and crash in a flash he was down. He broke his leg and he banged his head and he ended up in a hospital bed in a faraway part of town. Goodbye, McTat said. I must get back to Fred. But where had the busker gone? The sun went down and the sky grew dark. The stars came out, but he didn't come back. McTat lingered on and on. A week later, Sock took a stroll around the block and found her new friend looking thin. He's gone off and left me, said Tabby McTat. Then Sock said, my people Prunella and Pat would gladly find room for a fine Tabby cat. She was right and they took McTat in. Next morning old Fred left his hospital bed and found his way back to town. But a brass band stood where the pair once sat and the band played this and the band played that. And Fred looked all round for his loud meowed cat. But Tabby McTat wasn't there. Now McTat had a wife and a very full life with plenty of things to do. Like washing Prunella and pouncing on Pat. And hiding the car keys under the mat and keeping the newspapers nice and flat and giving the pens an occasional bat and nibbling this and nibbling that. But he dreamt of his friend with the old checked hat and always woke up with a meow. And often he said, what's happened to Fred? And his paws took him back to the square. But a conjurer stood where the pair once sat, and he pulled out this, and he pulled out that, and people threw coins in the tall black hat. But the busker was never there. 
One morning, Sock said, look under the bed and see the three kittens I've had. And Somis looked like this and Susan like that. And the littlest kitten called Samuel Spratt looked exactly the same as his dad. The three kittens grew and they learned how to mew. And McTat sometimes sang them his song. And Samuel Spratt, with his tabby grey fur, had a deafening meow and a very loud purr. And he simply loved singing along. Me, you and the old guitar. How perfectly, perfectly happy we are. Me, you and the old guitar. How perfectly happy we are. When Susan and Somis found very good homes, their parents were happy and proud. There was one home like this and another like that. But nobody wanted poor Samuel Spratt. They all said his voice was too loud. Now Tabby McTat was a home-loving cat, but he couldn't stop dreaming of Fred. And one day he called for his wife and his son and he told them, there's something that must be done. I must go and find him, he said. So up and down and all over town, he wandered a whole week long. For many a morning and afternoon, by the light of the sun and the light of the moon, till he heard a familiar song. Just me and the old guitar, if I had a cat, I'd be happier by far. Just me and the old guitar, with my cat, I'd be happier by far. It's Tabby McTat, my long lost cat. Old Fred was ecstatically glad. And then the two of them sang of this and that, and people threw coins in the new checked hat. But why did McTat feel so sad? He was missing his wife and his comfortable life, and the dozens of things to do, like washing Prunella and pouncing on Pat, and hiding the car keys under the mat, and keeping the newspapers nice and flat, and giving the pens an occasional bat. But how could he tell the busker that? Then out from a shadow sprang Samuel Spratt. Oh, please let me be the busker's cat, he said with his deafening meow. Now Samuel Spratt is the busker's cat, with a meow that is loud and strong. The two of them sing of this and that, though Samuel sings just a little bit flat. And people threw coins in the old checked hat, and this is their favourite song. You all remember it? Me, you and the old guitar. How perfectly, perfectly happy we are. Me, you and the old guitar. How perfectly happy we are. Oh, I like that story. That's one of my wee boy's favourite stories. Oh, well. Now, the next song we have is all about animals, and it's one you'll definitely all know. And just before we start, oh, we've got Donnie and Ennis. Morning! We're going to sing Old MacDonald. So you, if you know the actions, you can do all the sounds. Join in and you can jump up and down and dance if you want as well. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had some cows, E-I-E-I-O. With a moo-moo here and a moo-moo there. Here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo-moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had some ducks, E-I-E-I-O, with a quack quack here and a quack quack there, here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack quack, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had some pigs, E-I-E-I-O, with a here and a 
There he da, there da, elevator. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had some dogs. E-I-E-I-O. With a woof woof here and a woof woof there. Here a woof, there a woof, everywhere a woof woof. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had some sheep. E-I-E-I-O. With a ba ba there and a ba ba there. Here, here a ba, there a ba, everywhere a ba ba. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Oh, that's a good one. My singing's not that good, so it's not a great one for me. Oh. Now. We have this little piggy. Do we all know this little piggy? Sometimes mummies might do it on your toes. So this little piggy went to market and this little piggy stayed at home. This little piggy had roast beef, mm, yum. And this little piggy had none. And this little piggy went wee, wee, wee all the way home. Try that one again. You got your fingers ready. This little piggy went to market and this little piggy went at home, stayed at home. This little piggy had roast beef and this little piggy had none. And this little piggy went ee all the way home. Awesome. Okay, well the next rhyme is about a little fish. It's a counting one that we done the other week. One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let it go again. Why did you let it go? Do you all know? Because it bit my finger. So which finger did it bite? This little finger on my right. Oh, nice. Right, so I've got what, another one here. This one's about, look at this little mouse with its big long tail. We done this one the other day as well. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one and the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock. Oh, do that one one more time. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one and the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock. Excellent. <clears throat> right. Well, I think we'll try. Will we try that tongue twister again? Then we'll do Katie Bardy again. Because that's a bit of a tongue twister too and you can dance to that one. Are we all ready for Hey Diddle Diddle? We've done it at the start. Hey Diddle Diddle, the cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun and the dish ran away with the spoon. Can we do it one more time really fast? Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun and the dish ran away with the spoon. Yay! Well done, boys and girls. Okay, we'll do Katie Bardy one more time. And then I've got another one, and then we'll do a wee quiet song, okay? Katie Bardy had a coo, black and white about the moo. Wasn't that a dainty coo? Dance, Katie Bardy. Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum. Dance, Katie Bardy. Katie Bardy had a hen, toddle butt and toddle bin. Wasn't that a dainty hen? Dance, Katie Bardy. Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, dance Katie Bardy. Katie Bardy had a pig, no she didn't, aye she did. Wasn't that a dainty pig, dance Katie Bardy. Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, dance Katie Bardy. Katie Bardy had a cat, it would chase both mouse and rat. 
was nila ta hungry cat dance kitty bardi diddly diddle diddle dum diddly diddle diddle dum diddly diddle diddle dum dance kitty bardi kitty bardi had a duck it would have the best of luck was nila ta lucky duck dance kitty bardi diddly diddle diddle dum Diddly diddle diddle dum, diddly diddle diddle dum, dance Katie Bardy. Katie had a crocodile, have me seen her in a while. Dance Katie Bardy. Wow, very good. So, we have another song about animals, and I know that lots and lots of you love this one. We'll probably do just the one verse of it today. Well, we do sleep in bunnies again, boys and girls. I know you like to jump up and down. And I know that lots of you like this one. So if you want to get all comfy and pretend you're a sleeping bunny, let's do sleeping bunnies. See the bunny sleeping till it's nearly noon. Can we wake them with a merry tune? They're so still, are they ill? Wake up soon. Wake up, little bunnies! Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, hop, hop. I don't think you guys want me to finish this one. Will we do the little ponies then? Yay! See the ponies sleeping till it's nearly noon. Can we wake them with a merry tune? They're so still. Are they ill? Wake up soon. Wake up, little ponies! Trot little ponies, trot, 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 trot little ponies, trot, 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 trot little ponies, trot, 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 trot. Oh, well done, boys and girls. That was lovely. Did you enjoy that one? Yeah. Okay. What do you think the last song is? It's the one that we do all the time. Or maybe it's not. Will we do a little spider? Yeah. Right. There's a spider on the floor, on the floor. There's a spider on the floor, on the floor. There's a spider on the floor. Can you see any more? There's a spider on the floor, on the floor. There's... A spider on my arm, on my arm. There's a spider on my arm, on my arm. There's a spider on my arm, and he won't do any harm. There's a spider on my arm, on my arm. There's a spider on my knee, on my knee. There's a spider on my knee, on my knee. There's a spider on my knee, and he's very tickly. There's a spider on my knee, on my knee. Where's he going next? <gasps> There's a spider on my head, on my head. There's a spider on my head, on my head. There's a spider on my head, and I hope that he's been fed. There's a spider on my head, on my head. Oh, wow. That was fantastic, boys and girls. Well, all we've got left to do now is the goodbye song. That was fun today, all the different animals. So there's lots of you to say goodbye to. Are we all ready? We're going to clap our hands on our knees. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Glad that you could come. Goodbye everyone, goodbye everyone, glad that you could come. Goodbye Peggy and Ian, goodbye Harrison, goodbye Donnie and Ennis, goodbye Jamie and Georgie, goodbye Katie and Lexi, goodbye Archie and Angus. Well, who else have we got have we had on? 
good by Hannah mm -hmm. and good by Peppa, good by Sid and oh and oh I've just seen here it's Hunter's birthday today. So before we do the last verse of the goodbye song, will we quickly sing happy birthday to Hunter? Yeah, Hunter's three today. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Hunter. Happy birthday to you. Hip, hip, hurry. Hip, hip, hurry. Hip, hip. Hooray! Oh, lovely. Well, we'll do the last verse of the goodbye song. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Glad that you could come. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Glad that you could come. I, 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 I am glad that you could come. I, 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 I am glad that you could come. Thanks, boys and girls. We'll see you again on Friday. And remember, if you want to subscribe so that you get the notifications, just hit the subscribe button and we'll see you all soon. Bye.